yeah, that was the track from yesterday, and uh, hope you liked it. It's very interesting. Not too much going on. Hey, I want you to uh, see my buddies up here. Can you see them? In and out. I don't know if it'll focus in on them. Anyways, I got Mr. Uh, Batman Sir and here, and I've got Mr. Tiger there. All right. I don't remember what episode it was, but there was an episode where I told you the story of Mr. Tiger. Mr. Batman does not yet have a story. Um, well, I haven't told it at least, but he's got a story. Anyways, Tiger's got a story, and I told that in a previous episode of which I do not remember. So you have to watch them all, I guess. That's how this works, right? Anyways, before we jump in, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. It helps me out. Like crazy, and um, helps you out by letting you know when I throw out more nerdy stuff like these. All right, so let's hit it. I'm going through all of my software sounds, sound by sound. I am throwing each sound into a track, because I've got thousands of sounds that I've never heard of in my life. That's just what happens when you're a musician. You, you buy software, you get a bunch of sounds, and then you have no idea what half of them are. That's how it works. I don't know. It's the weirdest thing. But... I want to remedy that situation. So I'm going through all of my sounds, throwing each one into a track, and I'm having a blast doing it. So I hope that you are also having a blast. So today is episode 45, Cathedral Carillon, uh, is I'm guessing how you say it. Carillon. I don't know. I had to actually look up what um, Carillon is. So uh, here's, what it, here's what the Googles told me. The Googles said... The cathedrals carillon together these compromise <laughs> compromise these comprise the carillon quote unquote a set of bells played using a specialized automatic mechanism called a clavier which resembles the keyboard and foot pedals of a piano so something automatic with bells so I'm just gonna go ahead and guess that. This is a little bell type thing going on here, but we are going to find out right now. All right, let's see what this sounds like. I see where the cathedral comes in, and I see where the bells come in. That's dark and depressing. There are a lot of overtones going on here, lots of undertones or whatever. Um, there's a lot going on, lots of octaves. You can hear when I'm hitting it, even as high as the keyboard goes, there's still so much mid and even a little bit of low range in there. So it's got to have like one or two octaves below as well. All right. So with this tail reverb that's going on it's not anything that I can play super fast I mean listen to how long this lasts that's and it's gotta be at least 10 seconds um it's still going I can hear it right there anyhow It literally just died off. I could hear it in my studio speakers just there. Okay, so that that is longer than 10 seconds even. So I can't play anything super fast with it. I, it's got to be an accent piece or maybe like a one-hit type thing. Yeah, so it, uh, it's polyphonic, which I had a feeling it probably would be. All right, so I'm going to have to create on this one. I'm gonna have to create a track and then just use this as an accent piece or something interesting uh, over top so I think naturally going with the cathedral theme why not get an organ why not what do you think Batman Mr. Batman sir he didn't say anything because he can't speak because he's just a toy but if he wasn't a toy 
then uh, he would agree with me. So we're going to do an organ. All right, let's throw the organ. Nah, but I'm going to kill that click. I don't need that click. Get out of here, click. Be gone. Come on now, get yeah. There's like one chord in there that I wasn't super happy with, but it'll do for this. All right. Now let's see what else. What else we might be able to do. I don't know how much else there would honestly be. That organ's filling up a, filling up a massive frequency gap. Not that there um, is a gap now. It's just filling up every frequency, basically, that you can think, think or imagine. So I guess now we'll... Uh, I'll look into these bells. All right. Let's get these bells on. Couldn't find it. Mm. Anyways, whatever. All right, that should do. That should do. Okay, let me make sure there's nothing else, and uh, that I want to throw in there. But I mean, how many things are really in a cathedral anyway these days? Usually a pipe organ like this and some good old bells. All right, but I'll check anyways. Well, I'm not going to throw anything else on there then, but I did figure out the note. It's a minor third is what's weird in there. You can hear that. Minor third. It's a minor third. Okay. Enough of that music theory stuff. Don't need it. Actually, if you're a musician, you do need it. You need it a lot. But, let's rate the sound. Remember, if you've forgotten already, this is the sound. That's a cool sound. I wish that minor third one in there. That makes it tough to use. Let's rate. Let's rate it. All right, Cathedral Carillon. Again, so there are some awesome things with this sound. Like, I love the Cathedral Bells and all of that. I very much don't like that minor third in there because if I'm not using a minor chord <clears throat> at that moment and then I'm hitting those bells, it's going to be off unless I'm hitting the bells all by themselves. So it would have to be a minor just to use that, those bells. I don't like that. It, it makes it not very versatile to me. Okay, so <clears throat> I'm going to give it a one. I think I would give it a two if it didn't have that minor third in there, but that's that's kind of like a, a frustrating aspect, I guess. It's not super frustrating. It's just something that makes it to where I can't really use it as much. So I'm going to give it a one. I'm going to give it a one, but... That, that doesn't mean it's out for the count. Totally. It's just not my favorite. I wish it didn't have that minor third. Okay. Well, hey, 
<clears throat> hope you guys have a great rest of the week. Have a good weekend. Hope it's blessed. Hope it's amazing and sunny and bright and warm and all of the nice things as we're coming out of uh, the winter season. So be blessed and uh, we'll see you guys on the flippity flop.